Governor Tim Walz has signed his first two bills since taking office, one paying for fixes to the bulky Minlar's vehicle registration system and one reversing what critics called an illegal attempt to tap an environmental trust fund to pay for projects statewide. Walz told reporters Tuesday that bipartisan negotiations that brought the bills to his desk represented the hard work of governance. He paid tribute to lawmakers from both parties who helped reach the compromises. I'm here to tell you that we came to a compromise that's in the best interest of Minnesota taxpayers and Minnesota citizens. We compromised and provided services across the, the breadth of the state, uh, and we did so in a manner that's befitting to bipartisan common decency and governance. And again, I always like to say you, you shouldn't really get patted on the back for doing the things that you're supposed to do, but if you watch what happens in D.C. right now, um, I'm pretty darn proud of what we did here. Walls called this a real run, but one with some training wheels on it for how they could reach deals to end the legislative session on time in late May. Republican Senate Majority Leader Paul Gazelka agreed that the cooperation is what he wants the end of the session to look like. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.